to my channel. I'm Starlight Connections, but you can call me Annalisa or Lisi for short. Thank you so much for coming back. Um, I am just watched the first episode of Naruto and the nostalgia was just so... It just took me back to my childhood. And I'm just going into the second episode now. So I'm not going to stuff around and get right into it. So 80s. What are you? What do you have on your face and hand? Oh. He will crack first. Fan service. This is why anime will never be for children, no matter how many people think it is. It's not. That was a lot of blood. Jeez, get to know him first before just throwing out assertions like that. He's still going. Is he still going to him? He did. He still did it. Different. I was going to say that's incredibly mature of you, Naruto, but the last bit of that, but still, that was very mature of him. Lord Hokage, I've been looking for you. For what purpose? It's about Naruto. Did he resubmit his ninja ID photo? Mm. You know, I gave him a big lecture the other night at the ramen shop. But he's still beaming because he became a Ganin, a ninja trainee. He thinks that'll change things. That people will stop looking down on him now. Mm. I fear his dream may not come true. People don't change that easily. Huh? The nine-tailed fox is within him. Not everyone knows that, of course. Only those who fought the beast 12 years ago know the truth. I decreed that no one could speak about this, even those who whispered it were punished severely. So the children of today know nothing about Naruto's connection to the beast that ravaged our village and nearly destroyed us all. As long as the children are unaware of this, Naruto has some hope of being accepted. That was the wish of the fourth Hokage. Before he sacrificed himself to save us, he asked that when Naruto grew up, he should be regarded as a hero. A hero. The fourth Hokage defeated the fox by sealing its spirit in a newborn baby whose umbilical cord had just been cut by containing the fox spirit within. Gosh, that is such a huge burden, and Naruto had no idea. He didn't know why people treated him so horribly. Gosh, that's just so. That's so messed up. I get it, I get it to a point, but 
man no wonder there was a moment you could tell there was a moment in the first episode where he did consider revenge but it was because he heard the way you Iruka spoke about him in that moment that that changed him that changed that moment of seeking revenge it's a little harsh very harsh I can tell that this is going to be a really harsh world like I remember I, I watched this as a kid but I don't remember all of this at all but um yeah I do remember thinking as a kid that it was pretty heavy <laughs> let's keep going such things, Iruka. What's that, sir? When the people reject someone's very existence and then look at that person, their eyes become cold. Cold as an ice storm in the deepest winter. Poor Naruto. Not fair. This is that guy. Hmm. The yeah. That's what I mean, like, and he's so confused by it. He doesn't know why they look at him that way. But, um, now that he knows that he's a Ninetale Fox, I think he is starting to deduce, make that deduction of why, but... Gosh, that would have been so confusing and just so isolating. It's just horrible to treat people that way, especially a child. Because he is still a child. Now hang on a minute. That is a lot of blood. That was more than the third guy. <laughs> That actually gave me goosebumps. <laughs> very mature of you, Naruto. And very forgiving in a way too. For lots of sweat and tears while you're learning to be a ninja. Hmm. Oof. The wind blows. <laughs> By the way, there is no easy way to becoming Hokage. Believe me. If you really want to be a Hokage, you're gonna have to defeat me in battle. Because <laughs> mm. tomorrow I start my advanced ninja studies. But I accept your challenge, and someday we'll fight for the title of Lord Hokage. Mm. So let's both look forward to that day. Wanna... That's right. Because of Aruka. Naruto understands that what he was, went through has placed him on the path to succeed and that although he went through all that horrible struggles he's using that to fuel him and to keep him going and following a path of good and letting go which is incredibly mature of him incredibly 
incredibly mature of him. I really, I'm really, really enjoying it so far. The nostalgia that it's bringing me is just so good. And just some of those lines, you know, as I said, so mature. Well, thank you so much for tuning in. I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe and like this video and continue tuning in and seeing more Naruto reactions, K-pop reactions, so on and so forth. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.